Hello guys, Simmons here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get a free Minecraft server without like like getting up, like downloading Minecraft server .exe, and going to websites and doing a bunch of other stuff. Well, for some kind of reason I cannot make a public Minecraft server, but I still can't. Though there's another way to make a Minecraft server just onto this one website. It's called Eternals.org. And so if this is the website. All you have to do is sign in, and uh, that's basically it. You just sign in, and then you go to my server. And you find information, you find options. And though, if you want. Well, the, there's a limit of 10 players. If you want it to make like public, you want to like invite people over to your server, play with your friends. It's okay. Though, there is software, which is vanilla. There's plugins, there's crap bucket, and it's big odd. There's mod packs from Technic Launcher, ATL, FTB, and Technic, and others. But. I use vanilla. I'm using vanilla right now. Actually, I'm not. I'm using crap bucket. If you want to get add-ons, you need to click on craft bucket, and you can pick any version you want. But you do. You have to get plugins on the correct version. So there's whitelist and OPs, but that's well, not compatible. Minecraft 1.7.6 and higher. So and there's IP which don't need that right now. I don't think you need that. I never use this because and there's a version. But first let's look at the options. So if you want a light whitelist you just click on yes but I don't I don't think whitelist will work. Uh, if if you're if you do if you wanna play Minecraft one point six point one point seven point six and under you can do whitelist but and there's game mode, online mode Premium Cracked, Game Mode, Survival Creative Adventure, Difficulty, PvP, Command Block, Fly, Animals and Monsters. There's send commands when you're when you're start when you start running your server. You have send command, you can send commands for your server. So once you edit your options, you click on software that you want. That's basically it. But if you if you want if you just want regular vanilla, you cannot add add-ons. But it's just regular Minecraft. And but if you want add-ons, you click on Crap Bucket. I don't know about Spigot, but I recommend using Crap Bucket. And then you have to go to Files and Plugins. Once that's loaded up. There's there's my plugins. I have battle kits. I have better pack, pack backpacks. Though, if you didn't know about these add-ons, you have to edit them. Like going to battle kits, and then you, for example, you have battle kits. Okay. There's supposed to be something else, but whatever. Let's go to another one. Like better backpacks. I don't know. I just want to show you. And there's a config file. You have to edit that config file to make it work. Or, well, a lot of them they have like stuff in them. But for jobs, for example, it does jobs don't have any. They don't have anything inside their config files. So you have to you have to edit them so you can make them work. For some of them, you have to edit them. Or if you want. To add them a little bit to like make your own. For example, for jobs you make your own job like I don't know, woodcutter or lumberjack. Woodcutter and lumberjack are the same, but <laughs> so you see install plugins and there's a whole bunch of plugins you can select. So armor hider, for example. Okay, so you clicked on 1.7.9, and you're like, oh wow, I can get that. So you can get that. 
and you can get Ara, but it's got like a lot of PvP games for PvP games. Crap. And there's Autocraft. You can get that too. Auto price. I don't that does. And you can get that. And there's auto pickup. You can get that too. That <laughs> there's a lot. There's auto message. I am assuming you can get. Yep, you can get that too. If you pick 1.7.9, you you need to pick 1.7.9 R01, R01, 2, and 3. You can pick all three. I guess it still works. So be here, Brian. Oh, you can't pick that one because you know why. <laughs> The version, your version is not on here. It's only for 1.5.1, and that's the highest version for this add on. So you cannot pick that. If you pick that, it won't work. So it's really cool. It's really awesome. I use this server a lot so I can play with my friends. But this is not, you cannot make a public server, but it's. You can make a public server, but 10 people maximum. But, though, it can be a public server, but it has a limit. It has a, um, a time limit. If, you, if you're not using all your slots, it will end. It will stop. So you have like a 10 minute, at least a 10 minute limit to make all your people, all the people go inside your server. Just letting you know. I turn around. It's not a public server. Just a maximum of ten people. So yeah, that, those are the add-ons. And it says you download your add-ons. You can go to my server and you can start up Minecraft. Mine's one point seven point nine. And this might take a little bit. And one point. Well, I'm in one point eight point seven. And then you click on play. Alright. Now, since you started on Minecraft, you go to multiplayer and wait. Well, since it's gotta start up really fast. Well, a minute and a half. A minute? I thought it was gonna start in like two seconds, but I'll see you when it's about to start. Alright, so since that's loading, see I have like a six and a half minute limit, but I have one. If you want to do it by yourself, or you want to do it with like another friend, you can put it up to two or three players. You had to copy and paste this IP, but though it's a DYN IP, so so on Eternals.org, it switches the IP. So for example, this is Viper Eternals, and then there's a port. It once you stop it, but if you restart, it will be the same IP. But if you stop it and you start back up, it will change into like for uh, example, cow dot eternals dot org, and then a different port. It's got to do that. It will just do different ports. Like I don't know. So you put into direct connect, or you can put it to add server if you want to. But I recommend using direct connect. Guess there's no point using that server. Um, so there you go. There's your here's your server, and if you want to look at the add-ons that you downloaded, you click on help, and there, you can uh, find your add-ons. And there's chairs. So the chairs add-on. There's the easy warp, and there's the chairs add-on. So I can sit on stairs. See for some reason I can't sit on them. Now I can. There we go. So there's this the um, chairs add-on. You can uh, find it. You can just search it up. You can just search it up, and you can find it easily. And here's my uh, survival world. Yeah, these houses look kind of nice. I'm making a barn right now. I don't know how it look. How it will look. So this is eternals.org. It's not a public server, but I know a lot of you out there wanted to make a public server, but it's just that Eternals.org, I don't, I like, I wanted to make a public server, but this is, and I don't want to do a bunch of hard stuff. I don't want to, like, do a bunch of stuff that you have. 
so do a bunch of stuff that you had to do to make a public server. So, at Ternos.org, you can just play with your friends, you can play with other people online. You can make this a public server, but it's just at the maximum of 10 people can go on this. So, yeah, this is, this is at Ternos.org, you, you can make your own server. Like, one of my friends, we wanted to, like, play Minecraft when we are in different locations. Instead of just coming over to each other's houses and go on land worlds. But if we wanted to make a server so me and him can uh, play together. So we can <clears throat> actually play Minecraft together instead of just going to each other's houses and go on land worlds. And So Eternos.org, really, really good website. Really, really good website to make your own servers. Um, me and Sierra, well, what, my friend Sierra Full, we made a creative server, we made a Volt server. It's really, and I, we had a person who comes, oh, we had a, we had a, cut, and 50 seconds. So we had a person come over to our servers. Yeah. So that's basically, basically about it. Thank you so much for watching. Please comment, subscribe, and I'll see you later in my videos.